Let's study chemistry together with CBSE Chemistry Tips and Tricks. The following result have been obtained during the kinetic studies of the reaction 2A plus B gives C plus D. Determine the rate law and the rate constant for the reaction. What is our task? Our task is to find rate law and rate constant. Okay, so first we can write rate law with unknown orders. Okay, R is equal to K concentration of A raised to X, B raised to Y. For completing the rate law, we must know K that is rate constant and also X and Y. Okay, we can try. Okay, we can write the rate law for all these four experiments. Okay, so for the first experiment, what is the equation R? What is the rate? 6 into 10 raised to minus 3 is equal to K. Concentration of A is 0 0.1 raised to X. B is also 0 0.1 raised to Y. Now second one. Okay, second one is what? 7.2 into 10 raised to minus 2 is equal to K into concentration of A is 0 0.3. You can see raised to x concentration of b is 0 0.2 raised to y similarly you can write the equation for third and fourth experiment so it should be like 2.88 into 10 raised to minus 1 is equal to k into 0 0.3 raised to x into 0 0.4 raised to y last one it is 2.4 into 10 raised to minus 2 is equal to k into 0 0.4 raised to x into 0 0.1 raised to y okay right so we have four equation equation number one equation number two equation number three equation number four by choosing suitable equation you are supposed to find x and y so we can choose two and three for finding y okay so if you divide equation 3 and 2 3 with 2 or 2 with 3 that is your choice what will happen see this is common right 0 0.3 raised to x 0 0.3 raised to x they are common they will cancel off so you can find y got it right okay so 3 divided by 2 or 2 divided by 3 okay we can do that so i am doing 3 divided by 2 so what is that 2.88 into 10 raised to minus 1 by 7.2 into 10 raised to minus 2 that is on the LHS part RHS part C for uh, third equation we have K into 0 0.3 raised to X into 0 0.4 raised to Y for equation number 2 we have K into 0 0.3 raised to X into 0 0.2 raised to Y now you can see k k get cancelled 0 0.3 raised to x 0 0.3 raised to x get cancelled okay see now dividing 2.88 by 7.2 you will get 0 0.4 10 raised to minus 1 by 10 raised to minus 2 you will get what 10 correct is equal to 0 0.4 by 0 0.2 whole raised to y clear so it becomes 4 is equal to 4 by 2, right? 4 by 2 whole raised to y. So what is that? 2 raised to y. You know what is 4, right? 4 is 2 square. So 2 square is 2 raised to y. So y is equal to 2. We got y. Y value we got, okay? 2. Y value is 2. Now our task is to find x. Check it, okay? Make sure you understand this. So we got y is equal to 2 that you keep in mind. Now our task is to find what x. See for that choose equation number 1 and 4. You can see if you divide 4 with 1 or 1 with 4. It's up to you. You can see y terms get cancelled off. So you can find x easily. Correct? Okay we can do. So equation number 4 divided by equation number 1. So what is that? On a let us part 2.4 into 10 raised to minus 2 by... 6 into 10 raised to minus 3. On RHS part, we have K into 0 0.4 raised to X into 0 0.1 raised to Y. This is for fourth equation divided by equation number 1. It is, you can see this is the RHS part of equation number 1. So it is K into 0 0.1 raised to X, 0 0.1 raised to Y. So this part cancel off, right? Correct. So what you will get? See, or, see this get cancelled, right? So, 2.4 by 6. 
So you will be getting 0 0.4. 10 raised to minus 2 by 10 raised to minus 3, you will get 10 is equal to 0 0.4 by 0 0.1 whole raised to x, right? So it becomes 4 by 1, correct? So 0 0.4 into 10 is 4. Other side it becomes 4 raised to x. So 4 raised to 1 is 4 raised to x. 4 you can write like what? 4 raised to 1, correct? So LHS 4 raised to 1, RHS 4 raised to x. So x is equal to 1. You already know what is y, right? y is equal to 2, x is equal to 1. So we got everything right. Now we are supposed to find rate constant also. Okay, we can find. So we find x and y. y is equal to 2, x is equal to 1. Correct. Now see our next task is to find rate constant. So for that you can take any of the equation. I am taking equation number 1. So what was equation number 1? R is equal to k concentration of a raised to x b raised to y r value is 6 into 10 raised to minus 3 k we have to find a value is 0 0.1 x value is 1 b value is uh, sorry b value is 0 0.1 here right and raised to 2 correct now it should be 6 into 10 raised to minus 3 is equal to k into 0 0.1 means what 10 raised to minus 1. 0 0.1 square means what? 0 0.01. Okay, so 6 into 10 raised to minus 3 into k into 10 raised to minus 1 into 10 raised to minus 2. This is 10 raised to minus 2, right? 0 0.01. Okay, so what is that? 6 into 10 raised to minus 3 is equal to k into 10 raised to minus 3. 10 raised to minus 1 into 10 raised to minus 2 is 10 raised to minus 3. Cut it. So what are you getting? k is equal to 6 and that is our final answer k is equal to 6. Now regarding rate law, if you want, you can rewrite, rewrite it. So what is that? r is equal to, what is k? 6. Okay. Now, uh, sorry, you can write k. k, concentration of a raised to, what is the power? 1. And b raised to, what is the power? 2. So that is the rate law. r is equal to k, that value is 6. A raised to 1, B raised to 2. So that is rate low. And this is the value of rate constant.